guys, welcome back! Today we are going to 3D print large objects using a method called vase mode. Let's get into it. Okay, so let me explain vase mode. Okay, so what vase mode really is? Well, basically, if you want to print a large object and you wanna do it fast uh, or let's just say that you wanna create a big old vase but when you load it into your slicer it will create a circle inside the outer curve and uh, vase mode is basically a tool that removes that one for you and with that a lot of other unnecessary things first of all you need to activate vase mode let me show you how to do it. So, uh, basically how to do this is uh, to scroll down on the bar on the right uh, till you come to the... Um, oh, what, whatever it's called. And click on that and uh, this uh, little uh, screen pops up and then you should search on the searching menu uh, for um, outer contour and uh, then click that little letter box that pops up and um, close the screen then when you go to your bar again uh, click that box, box that appeared and uh, you're done when you have done that you could download anything that looks like a vase or a uh, you know wall or a crystal or or basically anything that you think that will hold up with only one perimeter. Then import it to your slicer and basically print it. Okay, so this thing weighs like nothing. I, I mean, really, it's very light and it's a little bit flexible too, even though it's PLA, so kind of interesting, I guess. Anyway, let's, uh, let's print something even bigger.
Okay, so I'm just about to start the biggest print I've ever made. Not good. Um, yeah. Um, oh no. Hello. Um, Yeah, I have no idea whatsoever what happened and um, the GoPro's memory is of course full so I don't know if it got it recorded but definitely, um, definitely the print failed. I mean, it looks like some kind of filament jam or something and uh, and um, okay so right away I noticed something and that is that this cable oh sorry for the focus this cable um, came out um, from the sensor um, that's because uh, when the this cable was too short and uh, basically you know you know what happened it stretched and it came off so this video if you liked it remember to like and if you didn't like remember to dislike and also remember to subscribe to the channel for more videos see you in the next video bye let's go editing